Hey everyone, and welcome to Don't Eat Dog Gaming. Uh, we're primarily going to be focused on Diablo Immortal because that is what I'm currently addicted to. Um, and uh, I play the game on PC, and I'm going to go ahead and share some tips and tricks on how to make your playtime on the PC uh, a little bit better. In this video, we're going to be talking about the mouse cursor. Now, as you can see, the mouse cursor um, is quite small, and if you have a high DPI display, it's going to get even smaller. Uh, it's not very high resolution or high quality. You can see all the pixels on there. Um, and if you're, you know, there's explosions going on, all kinds of combat, you have no idea where the mouse is. You don't know where the heck you're clicking. Uh, so there's actually, actually a solution to that. Um, and I actually saw it uh, probably about half a year ago. Um, somebody shared a video from a uh, demon hunter at the time named Snowlit. So shout out to her. Um, where she was using an animated mouse icon. And uh, I looked into it because I was tired of the of the little stock vanilla cursor. And it's a program called YOLO Mouse, and it's actually uh, very easy to use. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and launch it and see what, what happens here. Uh, it's just called YOLO Mouse, exactly the way you would think. And as soon as that happens, it swaps out the cursor for this one. Now you're not stuck on this one. You can use whatever uh, cursor you want. So I'll, I'll, sh I'll show you here. You hit Control-Alt-C, and it'll bring up a little mouse cursor uh, selection. So on the left-hand side, you can see all the icons that have been, uh, or cursors that have been used uh, recently, um, including this one here, which is a chat bubble, and I'll show you that in a second. But for the primary icon, uh, you can choose anything you want. Uh, currently, I've chosen this blue arrow, and you can choose your color as well as the size. You can max that out, uh, so you can basically cover up your character. Obviously, we're not going to do that. Uh, bring that down to 144. Uh, all kinds of animated icons if you want, you know, uh, so you can have fun with it. Now, one thing you got to keep in mind is you need to update the icon or select one for every instance. So when you mouse over uh, Bartender Bailey, for example, you're no longer using the stock icon. It's a, it's a chat icon. Now, I have updated it. Uh, you can see over here that the stock chat is that tiny little black thing. You can choose any uh, anyone you want, and it has uh, some pre-set uh, icons that will work like the speech bubble and I've chosen orange and you can choose the size and once you apply it and you can use anything you want right we can change the color to red for example and when you mouse over that it's red so very very easy to do um, and that should make your life a heck of a lot easier we're just going to go back to the default one here um, and you'll have to do it for, you know, the, the vendors and everything. But that's the basic concept. Very, very simple and makes your life a lot easier. Now you can attack where you want without having to wonder where the heck your mouse is because your mouse can fill almost half the screen. Anyway, thank you for watching, guys. I appreciate it. And remember, please don't eat dogs. Dogs are for petting. Appreciate it. See you in the next video.